We present Leap, a neural network architecture for learning articulated occupancy of people. Our method is able to represent multiple persons and to generalize well to unseen humans. All these subjects are represented by Leap. Neural implicit representations have been proposed to model rigid 3D objects. They are continuous and allow for differentiable interpenetration tests with the environment. However, they are designed for static scenes and do not generalize to deformable objects, which makes them unsuitable for representing articulated 3D human bodies. One special case is Neural Articulated Shape Approximation Work, shortened NASA, that takes a set of bone transformations of a human body and represents the 3D shape of the subject with neural networks. While demonstrating promising results, their occupancy representation only works for a single subject and cannot encode multiple body shapes. Therefore, the widespread use of their approach is limited due to expensive per-subject training. We follow the good practice of traditional body modeling techniques and build our occupancy model in the canonical pose. Our second idea is to learn a generalized linear blend skinning function to transform any query point to the canonical space, where we can conveniently perform a reliable occupancy check. The input to our system is a set of bone transformations. They are first transformed by three encoders to a global feature vector that incorporates information about the human shape, structure, and pose. This feature is then customized for each bone by per-bone learnable linear layer. On the other side, the input query point is projected to the canonical pose via the inverse linear blend skinning network that predicts skinning weights as an intermediate step. These sparse weights are used to create a local point feature vector as a weighted average of the bone features. Lastly, an occupancy multilayer perceptron predicts whether the query point is located inside the human geometry by taking as an input the estimated canonical point, the associated local point feature vector, and an additional feature that is based on a cycle distance. For this additional cycle distance feature, we introduce another linear blend skinning network that maps the estimated canonical point to the posed space, thus defining a cycle as distance between this new point and the corresponding input query point. The cycle distance benefits the generalization of our method and produces significantly fewer artifacts. The displayed close-up animation shows that our model captures the pose-dependent deformations in the canonical pose. Compared to the baseline, the reconstruction quality of our method is significantly better and is able to express details such as fingers and face. Our method outperformed the baseline across all settings and evaluation metrics by a large margin. Lastly, we propose an efficient point-based loss that can be used to resolve collisions with the environment. A recent work, PLACE, generates realistic human bodies and scenes. However, it requires a pre-computed SDF to avoid collisions with geometry and often generates unrealistically penetrated humans when multiple people are generated in a single scene. Our method is able to effectively prevent intersections with other people and the mesh-based geometry without requiring an SDF. Our approach is robust and resolves even complex penetrations with the environment, which cannot be resolved with mesh-based intersection methods. Thank you.